This is Vince from the National Weather Service in Grand Forks with a look at our wet stretch of weather. This first slide shows the departures from normal rainfall across the area in June. The circled area on the scale on the right shows the colors that are associated with drier than normal conditions. Looking at the map, quite a bit of the area was drier than normal. However, there were a few areas that were wetter than normal, like around Cooperstown, North Dakota. This second slide shows the same map from July. The main dry area was over northeast North Dakota, although it was fairly dry from Washkish to Bemidji. This next slide shows the actual rain that fell over the past 90 days, which includes most of July, August, and September. Most of the area received 8 to 20 inches of rain during this period, with portions of northeast North Dakota on the lower end of this range. Fargo had 11.83 inches, the National Weather Service in Grand Forks 15.46, Devils Lake 5.32, Park Rapids 12, and Baudette 11.82 inches. This slide shows July, August, and September rainfall as the percent of normal. Most of eastern North Dakota and the northwest quarter of Minnesota show about 110 to 200 percent of normal. As you all know, a lot of that rainfall occurred in just a couple days last week. This slide shows the rainfall that occurred over the past seven days. The orange to red areas show where four to ten inches of rain fell. Some of the higher areas were Northwood at 8.73 inches, Norris Camp at 7.1, and Binford at 7. Looking ahead now for late September through early October, higher probabilities continue for above normal precipitation. For the first week or so of October, higher probabilities continue for above normal precipitation. Finally looking ahead into the first half of October, the same trend continues. People have been asking what this means for next year's spring flood. Above normal fall moisture is just one of the factors that goes into estimating how spring flooding may be. So it is too early yet to say too much about the spring flood. Thanks for listening.